My name is Peter Yu. I'm one of the pediatric general and thoracic surgeons at Children's Hospital of Orange County. And today we'll be talking about congenital diaphragmatic hernia. Congenital diaphragmatic hernia is a hole in the diaphragm. It develops when a baby is developing in the womb and uh, it allows things that are inside the abdomen to pass through or herniate into the chest. Uh, one thing that I do want to underscore is that uh, CDH is not the fault of anything that mom or dad does. There's nothing that one can do to cause CDH in your baby and there's nothing that one can do to really prevent it either. A congenital diaphragmatic hernia is concerning because it is potentially a life-threatening condition. Uh, in addition to having a hole in the diaphragm, which can alter or negatively affect the normal mechanics of breathing, the major problem associated with congenital diaphragmatic hernia is pulmonary hypoplasia and pulmonary hypertension. Pulmonary hypoplasia is a small lung that is sometimes inadequate to bring enough oxygen to a baby's body. Pulmonary hypertension is abnormally tight squeezing of the blood vessels in the lung. This is important because the baby's heart then has to pump extra hard against these tight constricted vessels and ultimately that can lead to heart failure and sometimes even death. After your baby is born, we'll use several measures to treat him or her. These include a breathing tube and a ventilator, sometimes strong medications to support the heart and lungs, and in rare cases, we might even need to use ECMO or heart-lung bypass. Ultimately, as a surgeon, I will fix the hole in the diaphragm, and I do that by making an incision on the abdomen, moving the intestines back into the abdomen, and then stitching that hole closed either directly or by using a prosthetic patch uh, to cover the defect.